all crew and passengers brace for collision we have a small wave going towards the boat right now today we're gonna be clicking the scuttle button on a ship full of passengers let's get started all right so let's go ahead and enter here get this thing started so we have a whole bunch of buttons right here that we need to click so we're just gonna turn on all this stuff right here single player mode because i do not have anyone else on the server besides me right now i do have a whole bunch of npcs actually spawned throughout this thing though and then there's like water tight bays over here how do we actually start this i think we have to go below the water line and actually go and start the boilers all right now we're in the steam box room we're gonna be activating ignite on all four of these and then this thing should start here just in a bit so all four of them and this will actually start lighting these things on fire so let's go ahead and get out of this room because it's about to get really hot in here and then to also start this we need to be activating air valves for both of these and there we go it should start and we have emergency steam eventing and then we're gonna put it on full actually we're gonna do that up there since we have single player mode on but as you can see we are putting out smoke perfect all right so we should start driving here we're gonna put this telegraph here on full so there we go it is on full hopefully we should start driving here now it's putting out black smoke hopefully that's normal um i don't know a uh, single player mode is on main battery okay we're gonna want that on probably external lights um horn oh okay that's cool and then we have the lights for this um wheelhouse here i don't think we need those on it's not like really dark out so we can do this oh here we go the propellers are slowly starting to spin i don't think that's gonna get us anywhere if they're spinning that slow um maybe hold on um there we go now they're starting to kick up all right we should start moving here in just a bit oh did i put it in reverse um uh oh uh oh shut it down shut it down stop don't go in reverse stop 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 oh this is bad guys this is really bad did i accidentally put it in reverse i think i did okay put it on full going forward now um hopefully we go the right way we are about to smack the island this is not good we're going to break our rudder here if we even touch this island we're on full speed right now full 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 here we go all right i think we're good dude that was so close there we go now it's starting to kick up all right so that was a little bit concerning but we are offsetting sail here or not really sail we don't have a single sail in sight we have a whole bunch of actual passengers packed on this thing but why don't we run through a bit of a tour so let's make sure we're going in a straight line here all right so we can go straight for a couple miles before we hit an island that's perfectly fine so up here we have our wheelhouse of course and what's down here hold on we're gonna look at the deck first um so we have like a little co-pilot seat right there or something i have no idea but then in front of the wheelhouse we have a second helm here um does this actually work it does what the heck so we have two steering wheels on this thing that is quite interesting and then what's going on up here and then we have our navigation quarters right here so this is where our navigation person sleeps at pretty nice in here honestly i like the interior in this thing it has like a cool red color and then we have the captain's quarters this is my room right here oh yeah it's kind of like an outside bay in the ship which is completely fine honestly i like it but we have some people out here really bright lights should we turn those off i think we should it's not like nighttime yet all right so up here we have a what is this oh my gosh oh there's a massive storage room in this thing dude i wonder what we could put in this okay that's pretty cool we're gonna close that all right but that's basically the bow of the ship on the outside then what's this um we enter from right here navigation room and the macaroni room okay interesting so we can turn on our map right here and we can zoom out okay so this is where we're at we're gonna be going that way and then we have our morse code person here so and then we have morse code and then the sos actual thing so just click three dots for morse code and then you hold it down for three times basically what it says to do so that's how you do morse code pretty awesome how they actually put that there but that's that room right there pretty cool navigation room and what's back here b deck cabin cabin oh there's two cabins right here these are really nice cabins honestly i would honestly love living in this thing all right so we're gonna close the cabin door make sure we don't have any water going in there it's basically the same thing on that side all right so then up here we have some massive air vents probably for the engine so what's over here um i need some lights in here okay activate the lights all right so right here is a very nice dining area with some cool tablecloth a fireplace oh yeah we're gonna activate that really nice in here honestly it's really luxury i like the feeling in here and then what's back here we have the smoking slash dining room all right so you can smoke in here cool cool debbie's probably gonna smoke that entire place up anyways so that's that room right there let's go back here see what's going on so we have the neotelic lounge oh yeah is this made for me um oh wow it really looks like it is look at these colors oh it's so nice in here okay so how do we turn on these lights all right lights are going on perfect looking nice in here we got my lounge in here oh yeah we got my colors going on we get a fireplace too and then what is this down here a sink button oh gosh guys you guys already know i'm gonna try clicking that um that's probably it's definitely too early for that but we're gonna try clicking that maybe in a bit here and we have the mess hall right here oh yeah looking nice with our dining table let's turn on some lights in here all right so this is where we're all gonna eat at all right i don't know if there's enough room for all of us but we'll figure it out but that's basically this bottom part right here and then if we go up these ladders we got two lifeboats oh yeah this is definitely necessary if i'm driving wait a second there's only three seats in each lifeboat guys this definitely isn't gonna work i think we have a little bit more 
than six people, and I am not loading both of these lifeboats. Okay, so that's going to be interesting. There's a floating crate out there. I don't know whose that is. It might be mine now. Um, No, it's not. All right, but that's basically all there is for up here. Then we have some air vents. Um, Oh my gosh, these actually like work. They go inside. What the heck? Okay, that's pretty cool. Like it actually goes inside the boat. I don't know how the boat's not flooding if that's happening, but okay. But let's actually go to the B deck now. So kind of below the actual main deck here, not below the water line yet, but here we go. So right here we have some cabins on both sides the ones on the top were like first class cabins these look like the third class or second class i hope if these are the second class i don't even know what to see the third class are gonna be but all right that's pretty cool and then we have the windless room all right so what the heck is this um i don't exactly know how this works at all anchor motor oh my gosh that's actually cool um it does work too i don't know oh wait it does that's actually so cool okay i don't want to mess with that all right so on the side here we have some more cabins of course all right looking great just cabins all right so what do we have right here a deck that's how we get back up and then we have the restroom right here with a toilet and an outside view of a nuclear power plant oh great all right so we're gonna close that i don't want to see that at all with an equipment room right here that's always necessary on these types of boats and a water closet um oh so this is like the janitor's closet or the or the room that we shower in i don't know one of the two and then we have the sea deck right here two entrances to the sea deck and then we have the same thing on both sides what's well, all the way back here um some more Oh, galley. Um, oh, this is where we make food at. Nice. Okay. Oh, we even got a worker in here. Hello. How are you doing? Um, awesome. I really like this. Okay. So let's even farther back here. Crew bunks. Oh, okay. This must be the, um, third class here. If it is not, um, I'd be surprised if it isn't, but you know, you never know. Um, crew mess hall. Okay. So we have another dining area down there for just the crew only. And then there's like some ropes right here that we can't get through, but we're going to get rid of those. Cause I'm going to get back here no matter what. Okay. Rudder engine. Here we go. Oh gosh. What's back here? here um hello hello oh okay um oh so it actually kind of worked it's a rudder engine okay so i'm gonna get out of there i don't really know what i'm looking at but that's basically this um b deck right here i think it's b and then now we're going down to c all right this is the way bottom of the ship right here so we are much below the water line right now so if we look outside we're way below the water line all right this is like a crew only area 100 so we got a storage area uh the big storage area right here with that hatch right there and then we got our boiler stuff back here so we have our our temperatures fluid volume with some steam turbines all right looking nice but that's basically the boat here oh here's the telegraph so we can have an engineer on this thing this is what they would be clicking if um didn't click that single player mode and then back here is just a little storage area so pretty cool that is uh basically the boat the waves are kind of starting to pick up i can definitely see that wait what in the world is that over there do you guys see that it looks like mountains but it's like a little bit like bouncy you guys see that what in the world is that dude okay something's going on with this server right now um wait a second wait a second uh i think that's a tsunami everybody clear decks clear decks we have an active emergency going on right now oh there's so many people out here there's absolutely so many people all right everybody follow me inside right now this is really bad this is like so terrible okay everybody follow me there's like 15 people out on the deck here oh here's debbie hello hello everyone follow me this is an active emergency are right, you two over here we need to get inside there is a small wave going towards the boat right now okay so now i have a line of like 20 people following me we are going to enter where should we even go in at um oh we need to hurry this up guys we need to hurry this up right now um okay so we're just gonna enter right here okay i'm gonna stuff all you guys in the b deck okay everyone go down here right now okay we're gonna put you there 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 okay you guys are all gonna be standing up i'm sorry that's not safe at all but i can't do anything else okay um i'll set you there i think we got everyone okay we need to get upstairs right now we need to get upstairs this tsunami's probably hitting us right now. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is terrible. Look at the tsunami. Okay, we need to go back upstairs. All crew and passengers, brace for collision. We have a small wave going towards the boat right now. This is going to be rough. Oh, I left someone out there. Oh, no. Okay, I'm so sorry about that, sir. Um, hopefully, he can hold on to those lifeboats. Please do not deploy them. Um, I We need those for the rest of the passengers. Here we go. We're going to be rising the tsunami here. Let's see if we actually survive. Let's see if we actually survive. All right, there we go. We're starting to rise it. Oh, we're starting to rise it. Oh, no. Oh, we're flooding with water through those air holes. Oh, this is not good, guys. This is not good. Here we go. We're going to get so much air time. Oh, my gosh. Um, Wait. Oh, our lifeboats. Oh, no. Oh, this is going to be here. Oh, uh, there we go. We hit the ground. Where did that person go that was standing on the top here? Um, Uh-oh. Okay, well, we're running still. We need to go on emergency stop. Emergency stop right now. Full stop. That's the um engine telegraph. We should switch to there. There we go. All right, so um, we are on emergency stop right now. We're having some issues. Okay, so some water is entering the boat. We're going to be closing all watertight doors right now. 
now that are below deck. All right, all watertight doors have been closed. Let's see what's going on down here. See if we have any water, dude. That was insane. We need to launch a search and rescue investigation to, to try finding that guy that actually flew off the boat. Um, I don't know if he's still on. We still have to look. But these light bulbs aren't really doing too well. I can say that. Um, let's see if we see. Um, I don't see him behind us anywhere. Oh, I do see him. Um, no, I don't actually. What are you guys talking about? Okay, so let's go inside, check up on all the passengers. I don't know how we're going to deploy those light bulbs after that, but okay. So this right here is the room that actually flooded with water. I think it's watertight. Oh, um, no, it's not. Okay, well, it's not watertight. We just saw a wave go over. Okay, that's a little bit concerning. Um, let's see what's going on over here. Any passengers? Where did I put these people at? I think I put them in like the B deck or something below the water line, kind of. That oil rig also just got hit. Um, I think they're fine though. All right, so down here is where I put all the passengers at. Let's see if they're all alive. I'm kind of hoping there are. All right, so we have passengers here. Um, they are all on full health, so I think we're fine here. All right, perfect. So I'm gonna be bringing you guys to your cabins here. Please just follow me. You guys will all have your own separate um beds. I'm not gonna say you're gonna have your own cabin, but you're gonna have your own bed. All right, so everyone follow me. It's about to get nighttime here. All right, so there we go. I have a whole bunch of people stuffed throughout this ship inside of their own like separate rooms and compartments. But down here, all all the watertight doors are closed so if you are down here you're basically screwed i can say that but let's open up all those doors right now i don't think it's a serious issue so we're gonna open all watertight bays perfect they should all be opened i hope they are we're going on full speed right now here we go there we go all right so now we are moving back up and moving so we're perfectly fine now i think um besides the light boats these waves are really starting to get crazy here i think i'm gonna go in my neotalic lounge here and just kind of chill out so where's it at was it the one right here perfect so neotalic lounge all right it's just me in here because it's my private vip access lounge oh yeah so we're just gonna chill right here on my table actually where's our food at that person down there should have been making our food already where are they at they're probably just sitting there doing nothing yeah right here you should be making our food you're just standing there well i mean since it's just me in here i mean i guess we could click that scuttle button right here all right we're gonna click the sink button should we do it oh gosh i don't know okay we're gonna click the sink what will happen here and sink is on um what will that do uh, i don't see anything happening to the ship currently um let's go kind of let's go below deck here we're gonna go to b deck that door was already open and that's probably not good okay so what's going on down here anything hello hello i don't see any water so was it fake does it even work that is the real question what is that oh it definitely works guys it definitely works there's water in here oh my gosh okay all crew all crew we are going down okay everyone get out of their cabins right now it's time to wake up everybody emergency emergency you need to all wake up right now oh gosh there's no way i'm getting all these people out of their cabins okay all right i got everyone on the left side that's about all we're gonna do for now okay so we're gonna be going back upstairs oh Oh, never mind. That's not upstairs. Okay, we need to go back upstairs. We are currently flooding down there. Oh, come on. I have to, like, walk them around so they can get around the door. Okay, here we go. Guys, I think we're going down. We're going down right now. Oh, we definitely are. Get upstairs, you guys. Oh, my gosh. You guys are flooding my boat. Okay, close that. Um, 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 we need to go back up to the light bulbs. Light bulbs right now. This is an active emergency going on here. Okay, so we climb up this ladder here. I'm going to start loading you guys on light boats. All right, follow me. Get on the light boats. Here we go. You guys will go on this one. Oh, this is really rough, guys. I think we're going down. I don't know. I haven't really looked at the boat yet. Um, sir, you guys need to come up here. What are you doing? We're going to be closing all watertight doors right now. Oh, this is really bad, guys. Look at this thing. Hold on. We're, yeah, it's definitely not looking too good. All right, full stop. We're going full stop here. Um, Full stop. Here we go. Full stop. This thing should go to a complete stop here. We got three people loaded on that light boat. I think I need to go down below deck here and load some more people up. So here we go. We're going to go down here. Oh, this thing's really going down, guys. There's water completely over the deck right now wait a second how am i gonna get down there okay i need to hurry this up i think guys oh wait can we even go down there without flooding this thing even more i don't think we can um oh gosh this is really bad it's getting higher and higher as we speak i might just um go on my own light boat here okay we're gonna deploy the light boat we have filled with people right now um sir you need to follow me up this ladder here all right so how do we deploy these light boats can this light boat move oh wow i'm really strong i push that thing okay so we're gonna do uh lower here oh um wait how do we actually extend this thing how do we extend the divot okay so we go over here and extend it just like that perfect oh um that looks really sketchy okay i'm gonna push you guys off uh it's all part of the plan here yep oh that does not look safe at all oh my gosh okay um lower lower there you go I have lowered you guys you guys are on the water you guys should be floating i'm going to be disconnecting the ropes right now okay here we go we're disconnecting them perfect all right we have a crew of three right there um they are alive dude this thing is going down from the bow it is going so fast oh my gosh okay this is going much faster than i thought it would um there's still a ton of people inside this light boat is not like looking too good to actually load okay so 
we're gonna put that one right there extend it oh oh gosh i'm sorry sir it's just how it goes um dude them water tight doors i don't think they're working that well this is just um not looking too ideal i can say we're just leaning farther every second here okay we need to hurry this up we're going to lower you in the water all right nope lower here we go all right sir are you in the water tell me when you're in water okay you're in the water disconnect the light boats oh gosh okay here we go we're going down um i think it might be time for the captain to get on the lifeboat i don't know if that's a good idea or not but let's go below deck here see what's going on so um this there's no water down here what the heck yeah there's still people probably alive in their cabins here i don't know what's going on there's like literally no water even in this room right here like there's none um right here there's kind of a lot and oh okay i kind of found where the water's at okay and then if we look in these rooms here i think we put our um navigation person he's still in here um uh, yeah uh he's completely underwater sir i'm sorry you're gonna have fun down there um we got a light boat loaded right there and then another one right there with one person um probably getting fired after that one I really wish you could be on morse code right now telling us that we're going down oh it's flooding in that room look at my loud just completely flooding oh no are you joking me hello people on the light boat how are you guys doing over there um i'm not doing too well honestly i'm still on the boat this thing's really starting to angle upwards guys i'm gonna lose my grip oh it's going down so fast okay I'm gonna get on the um, stern of the ship right now. I think this is it. This is definitely it, guys. Oh, it's going down straight vertically. Here we go. Oh, this is rough. I'm standing really close to the propellers right now. Can you guys please save me? Although I am your captain. No, I'm actually a passenger now. Okay, even though I'm a passenger, can you guys please save me? Oh, this is so scary. We're so high up right now. I do not want to jump because I'd probably hit the propellers out of everything. People on the light boat, you might want to watch out for these propellers. They are kind of spinning. I don't know how, to be honest, but they are. Look how fast that thing's going down. What in the world? After every Every wave it just keeps going down lower and lower what in the world just happened to this thing that scuttle button must be going crazy because this thing is just yep there it goes it's going down pretty quick now um people on the light boat can you please save me it's going down really fast please row yourself towards me i cannot swim oh no here we go oh the ship has completely sunk there it goes oh the and that will be at the bottom of the ocean so yep there it is still actually going down pretty quick so it's gonna hit the ocean floor probably damage the front bow right there and it will sink much faster um there's still a ton of passengers in that thing by the way um let's kind of see what they would be experiencing so let's go down here um hello um nope this is completely filled with water in here okay so they'd probably be dead there's still people in these cabins though it is waterproof in here so they're still alive that's um a little bit Concerning. they're gonna wake up and be like what in the world but um over here is completely water um i'm in air but then there's water okay then the actual engine room is completely fine basically because of those watertight doors i bet if i open those watertight doors this thing's gonna completely flood why don't we do that that seems interesting the helm actually has no water in it okay we're gonna open all these doors here this is gonna get really rough for the boat all right here we go all doors are open this thing's gonna sink so much faster okay yep there's water going through every compartment currently look at that this is what you'd be seeing in here that'd be an insane amount of pressure too just completely filling up in that room but there it is i had hit the bottom the bow really isn't damaged okay that's surprising but that thing is really deep down there we got our two light boats in the shadows um somewhere over here and then i hopped on the light boat to myself perfect all right hello sir how are you doing um yeah i'm your captain by the way i just uh clicked a button i don't know why it sunk i just clicked you know a button but that's probably gonna be it for this sinking video let me know if we should do some more of these of course but make sure you guys like and subscribe join the discord link is in the description but thanks for watching and goodbye